I started um, my engineering career doing energy efficiency work with solar and wind. I put up met towers and fields and went out and worked on wind farms all across the Midwest. I decided pretty quickly that um, wind energy wasn't, wasn't really gonna be what we needed. Um, and that was definitely my feeling going into it was wind power was gonna save the world. I didn't really understand nuclear power very much. I wasn't comfortable with it. And so I came to Ganae after that and worked here and completely changed my opinion on the matter. People don't understand that people coming to work in a nuclear power plant aren't just coming to work. They, they have the health and safety of the public as their paramount issue at work. I believe in this, and I believe in it not just on an efficiency standpoint, but on a safety standpoint. Well-trained people that we have working on things and the insanely high safety practices and the attention to detail. I believe very strongly that the reason that I work in a nuclear power plant is because I'm an environmentalist. Mothers for Nuclear is an organization of not only women, it's mothers, brothers, and others. Their whole goal is to preserve the earth and everything it has to offer to ensure that the earth that our children inherit is something worth having. So we go to groups of anti-nukes and talk to them. And we sit in their meetings and we go, okay, you know, we absorb their issues and then we challenge them I mean, nicely. We're trying to bring the human face to it, show people's stories, make it more obvious. It's energy for the people and it's a much happier, cleaner energy for the people. I'm a photographer. My love of the environment and my love of sharing that with people, I think is what prompted my love of photography. I tend toward wide open spaces. I think it's because it's what I grew up with and I, I find it very beautiful. Your emotion, your feeling on what you're looking at is so important. You're sharing your perspective. Part of why I actually enjoy advocacy is I get to hear why people think the way they think and what makes them tick a little bit. Everybody has their own perspective. That willingness to learn and to listen and to uh, consider other people's ideas and feelings and perspectives is very powerful.